So what's good people? Um, I wanted to do a video about Carl Crawford. Obviously, it's the big topic at the minute in boxing. It's a huge, everyone's talking about it. It's a, you know, it's a massive, massive, um, you know, fight uh, that could, could potentially be made. Um, if Crawford does manage to get the, the fight, you know, I believe that, you know, Crawford Khan is a massive fight for Terence Crawford because it could potentially uh, make Terence Crawford a household name. It could it could make Terence Crawford a name that I don't feel he's been in the US yet. I don't think I don't think Crawford has got a big a big name at all. If you look at his pay per view like pay per view against Postal, did like it, it, I think fifty thousand or eighty five thousand buys. It was terrible. So Crawford's not a massive name in in the in the United States, uh, but I do think Amir Khan has a very big following, and I actually think Amir Khan's a bigger name than Terence Crawford uh, in the United States. And I do think that this fight, if Crawford can win, of course, uh, it would definitely push uh, his name to that to that next level. Uh, I think he needed a name like Khan. Um, but again, this all comes down to whether I, whether he wins. You know, a lot of you think that you know he's going to win. I'm not so sure it's going to be that easy. I think Amir Khan's going to cause Crawford hell, and I, I I won't be surprised if Amir Khan beats him uh, because I think stylistically. Um, I don't think Khan's a very. I think it's a very, very risky fight for Terence Crawford. But if if we say that Crawford does win, I think it puts Crawford on another level. His name goes, um, his name goes from there to there. Uh, because I, I like I said, I think Khan has a big, big name in the United States, and I think if Crawford can manage to get a win, then what that does is it gives it it makes Crawford a. I won't say a household name. But it definitely makes him a big name and a big player uh, in the in United States. And I do think that maybe after that he can start, if with the right dance partner, can start doing pay-per-views. Because I think they stopped putting Terence Crawford on pay-per-view because, you know, he his first pay-per-view was shocking, you know, against Victor Postal. And I think that showed to them that he's not a star. He's not a pay-per-view draw. Let's not forget, a pay-per-view in um, America is quite expensive. So when you got when you when you got people that don't really know you, they're not going to pay, you know. Um, so, you know, it's a shame, really, because Crawford's an excellent fighter. He's a very talented fighter, but just unfortunately, he's not a name at all. He's not got he's not got that following. He's not got he's not got a huge name, uh, you know, and there's many fighters in America that that were like that. Andre Ward was another perfect example. He was a great fighter, but just didn't ever manage to kind of get his name out there for some reason. You know, American fighters seem to struggle. Uh, I look at Deontay Wilder and think, he, though his name is growing now, I still think that, you know, his name's not that big. For being a heavyweight champion, American, that, you know, is so brash, that punches so hard, that's so exciting. He's hardly, he's he's not, his name, in comparison to Joshua, is, is it's not big. It's not big at all, you know, when you, when you, when you look at the fact that, you know his country's massive. They should be you. They should be behind him, not, not um nobody knowing him. Tyson Fury walked, you know, in America, and was asking people, do you know who Deontay Wilder is? And nobody even knew who he was. And that's when you're a what heavyweight champion of the world. Um, in America, they should all know you. Really, I don't think you could walk the streets and ask people who Mike 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 Tyson is, and they won't know who he is. You know, and and that's the shame that you know Deontay Wilder is not that name. And Crawford. In my opinion, the best fighter in the world, uh, but people again don't know who he is. So it's and I just look at some of these guys' social media followings, and they have like seventy thousand, eighty thousand, hundred thousand. I'm like, you're you're like you're one of the best fighters in the world, and you've only got like hundred thousand followers. Like that's that's not great, is it? When you when you when you think about it, I'm such a big country like America, and you've only got hundred thousand, um, you know. Uh, followers, you know. Uh, on the other hand, Khan has two point two million followers, and he's from a country that's only got sixty million population, right? Um, and guys like Crawford has got like fifty, sixty, hundred thousand. It's it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable when you think at, at the difference in 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 popularity between the guys. But you know, it, unfortunately, you know Crawford, very talented, but not not. Not a huge name, but I do think this fight against Khan could put Crawford on another level. Uh, but again, 
he, he has to win. And like I said, I don't think it's going to be an easy fight for him. But yeah, guys, leave your thoughts. Uh, and guys, remember to please like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.